Hey there guys and welcome to John Drinks. Today we're going to be making a sherry cobbler. And this is a cocktail that first kind of crept up in a diary in 1838 and was made popular in Charles Dickens' Martin Chuzzlewit. The recipe normally calls for amontillado, however today we're going to be using our Oloroso as featured in the previous episode. If you haven't yet seen our review of that then you can click in the top right hand corner now. So to make this drink, we're gonna be taking some citrus first. I'm using blood oranges. And then we wanna do about a half an ounce of Monin syrup. You can use simple syrup if you like. I'm using basil syrup. And then we're gonna muddle the crap out of it. Now, because I'm using blood oranges, then it's gonna turn this kind of evil juice mix kind of thing. Then we wanna hit it up with roughly two ounces of our sherry, pour that in there like that. We're then gonna cap that off with ice and shake the actual fuck out of it. You're gonna need some crushed ice for this, and here you can see me attempting to crush some ice and doing a really bad job of it. I recommend either whacking a load of ice in a bag with mallet or just buying some crushed ice, because this was very time consuming. And you can see, I actually gave up. Pour your drink over a mixture of crushed and cubed ice as seen here, and then garnish with a lemon wheel and then a selection of fancy looking fruits. I'm going with grapes because it's a grape based beverage, and also because I hate the ocean, a straw. And then try to sort of take a fancy looking shot of it and kind of fail because the blurring on your camera is quite extreme. There's a bird's eye view, Ooh, isn't that much nicer? Thank you for watching this guys, and on your screen at the moment you'll be seeing two options for other clickable materials. Please do check them out, and if you enjoyed this, then do subscribe because I drink a lot.